Let us see how to start working in Oracle LaVinci environment. On successful installation of Oracle in Windows system, you will be getting this folder, Oracle. In that, if you go to the application development, you will be getting the SQL Plus. If you open that, you can see the SQL command prompt. You can directly start working in this or else. The other method is go to Windows command prompt, type CMD. You will be getting the Windows command prompt. Here, enter the command as SQL plus. Now it will be asking for the username. The username is always system administrator. The username is system. Hit enter. It will be asking for the password. The password is the one you have given during the installation of Oracle 11G. My password is manager. Now I am connected to the Oracle system. We can check the user by executing this command show user. Now it is showing that the user currently is system. Now we can start working in Oracle system by creating a user. Let me create a user named John. So for that the command is create user. Followed by the username John. Followed by identified by the password. Let me give the password as John one two three semicolon hit enter user is successfully created now the next thing you can do is you can start working as the user John for that we have to connect to the John user let me try that connect John Oops. Connect John is asking for the password. Let me get the password John123. Enter. It is giving error message saying that user John lacks create session privilege. It means that John is not having a connection permission. Let me give the permission for him. For that, the command is grant create session to John oops we need to connect as a system administrator connect system is connected let now let me give the permission grant create session to john grant is successful grant is succeeded now let me connect John to the system. Connect John Password John123 
is connected. Let me create one more user. For that, I should be the system administrator. Let me switch to the system administrator by connecting connect system system password. Let me create the user called allies. Create user followed by, by the name allies identified by the password. Let me give the password as allies at the rate one two three it, sh it gives the message error message saying that missing invalid or invalid option this is because in the password field I'm using a special character at the rate which is not allowed by the oracle system for that, we need to enclose this in the quotations. Let me try once again. Allies. Enter. User is created successfully. Now let me try to connect as allies to the system. Connect. Allies. Password. Allies. One, two, three. Log on denied. You are no longer they are connected to Oracle. This is because the lack lack of create session permission. So we need to assign create session permission. Let me give that connect as system. Password. Connected. Let me give the permission grant. Create session to allies. Grant succeeded. Now let me connect as allies. Connect allies. Password allies one two three. Still, I'm not able to connect to the system. This is because during the creation of the user, we have given the password inside the quotation mark. So we need to give that as the password. Now let me try. Connect as allies. Password should be inside the quotation mark. Allies. 1, 2, 3, closing quotation mark, hit enter. Oops. The error is because I did not include add symbol in the password. Let me try once again. Connect allies. Password is inside the quotes allies at the rate 1 2 3 close the quotation mark hit enter now it is connected now let me check the user allies connected to the system for that the command is show user the user is allies 
is successful. Now let me check the privileges assigned to allies. The only privilege we have assigned is create session. Let me check that. For that I, have, I need to connect to the system. Connect system password to check the privileges the command is select grantee comma username from dba underscore sys underscore prints where grantee is equal to allies here is not the username it is privilege Oops. From this is the result. The allies user is granted with create session permission. That's all for now. Thank you.